That's good. Howard's Grocery, Hebert, Louisiana. Don't go there. Because they sell out of them every day as it is. And I like to eat them. That's so good. We got four today, so we got to have some breakfast. Kill that one. Uh -oh. I don't know where he come from. He scared me to death. Oh, look at all the teal flying around right here. Right here on this side. Back. I'm going to have to slow down. Surgical precision. He is a little too hard, right? He is drifting down wind, though. Surgical precision. to shoot you flying you just wouldn't have none of it <laughs> what are you gonna do this ain't this only my third hunt teal hunt i've been in south texas what is that over there wow i hope that's teal if it is it's a hondo coming straight in <laughs> Do it. Look, I trusted you boys. I never fired a shot. Did you not? Huh? No, I was just pointing at them. There's two more right there. Right there, right there, right there. You just say when, huh? You get on it. Huh? Right upside your head. <laughs> Little bump side to his. You see him stick that neck out. Uh, yeah, it's like you whistled at him, like a deer. Matt, <laughs> and he went. only 7.30. There's a chance we could stay a little while, 8.30 or so, and get another bunch, but it should be a traveling day for these blue wings, uh, and we still have another 
nine days of the season left. So we, we got 13. We're going to pick them up and get out of here, let whatever ducks want to come in here the rest of the day, come in here, sit down. We're just trying to make sure we'd rather kill 13 for a few days than kill 18 one day. So we're, we're just we're trying to manage the pressure, um, all that kind of good stuff. So we're going to pick them up, get all the jump picked up, and we're going to head out. I'm trying to work off the reds. I'm still thinking about that bunch of 30 from this morning. So if I can get one bass to blow up on this frog, I'll be all right. I got you a present. Love it. This is what you get when you call the shot early on 30. I'm going to put this in the back of Jacob's truck for that move this morning. Oh, I bet that hurt. Look at that. Well, here we go. Hey, look, we got them Texans in here, son. They get rowdy. But, uh, anyway, it's September. We shot us some teal this morning. We caught a few fish today. Caught two gar, grin on bass. Uh, now we're checking the alligator lines. So we got some alligator tags. Uh, so that's what you do in September when you're a redneck in North Louisiana. But anyway, we're going to meet the boat over here. We're going to stay on dry land. But, let's see what we got on the line. Maybe we done caught us a big old lizard. Okay. Can you hand it real quick to me? I can't. He's right up underneath. Pull him up, pull him up, pull him up. Oh boy. Right, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hey, hold up, hold up. Hey, hold up. You better watch out. Right, let me see if I can get us. Don't let him bite your boat. Don't let him bite you now. All right, Arnie, if you can get on him. All right, look, you're going to have to try to get it to where that head's facing that way. Right. There you go, a little lower, right there. Lower, lower, lower. Safety. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Lower, lower, lower. No. Yeah, right there, right there, right there. There you go. Nice shot. That should, that should have got him. Hold on, let's see. We're learning. Yeah. These boys, you bring these Texans out here to shoot lizards. Yeah. We, we, we dry land people, man. <laughs> Guaranteed. <laughs> Thanks, Bradley. That's perfect. The lizards they got run so fast you can't even see them. What is up guys? Welcome to the afternoon shift. We're going, I think, basically for like the trifecta of September in Louisiana. We got teal this morning. We got gators midday. And now, now, we're going for some dabs. So, 
good news is this guy thought he was going to be funny and land on the power line while I was getting all my stuff out of the truck. What he didn't know, JM, always got a bullet handy. So, I got one out of my tool, ow, one out of my toolbox. Man, that plan had a pokey on it. <coughs> and, uh, <laughs> went ahead and got the day started off right. So, we got us one. So I guess technically we have the trifecta. But, I sure hope we can get a lot more than one. But we'll see. You never know. A little cool front, north wind. It's the first one we've had in a minute. Or really, all season. So, it'll make doves act a little bizarro the first couple of times they do it. Um, but, we'll see. You can't get them at the house. Look at here, let me show y'all something. Since I'm over here by Hunter Boy. This one here, he don't even count. He's just laying, yeah. This be a collared dove. For those of you that don't know, I'll show you why they call him a collar. Set deal on the back, back of his neck. It's a Eurasian collared dove. So Eurasia, he ain't even from around here. But uh, but we got us one. That's two. You should have went the other way, Hammer. Jacob up! That while ago didn't bother me. Them two right there, that bothered me. Yeah, that's, that's no bueno. Hey, I'm gonna go home. What a day. What a day. Teal, gators, doves. He don't get no more Louisiana than that. Look, hope you guys enjoyed today. A life in our a day in one of our lives in September. So like, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. We gone.